Today, we're gonna play a little game. We're gonna see if you can decipher between a real dockage and a fake dockage. Please share and subscribe to help grow the channel, and I hope you enjoy the video. All right, so sometimes I'm watching college basketball and I get fooled with thinking Dan Dockage is on the call. Then it turns out to be someone who sounds like him or just tries to imitate his style. Recently, I saw the same confusion on Twitter, thinking Dan was doing a game, but it turned out to be another analyst. So I'm gonna run through some clips, sometimes twice, listen in, and then I'll let you know after a few seconds if you are right or if you are wrong. Let's start out with a little example, just to let you know how this is gonna go. It's Tucker, -E it is Tucker, and that was his mom. She's jumping with joy. She said, that's my boy. Okay, that's clearly Dick Vitale, but that's just an example how this game is gonna go. Over the next several clips, you're gonna get tested. Keep track and let me know how you did at the end. Figuring out on the fly. I mean, it's kind of like a quasi Euro step. He kind of James Harden that thing just went. Figuring out on the fly. I mean, it's kind of like a quasi Euro step. He kind of James Harden that thing just went. That's what every team in the Big Ten non-conference is. And we saw the double team, right? You've got to in the Big Ten non-conferences that did that. We won a Big Ten championship. That Hoosiers feel to it a little. It does. We, we talked about it earlier. I think this is going to be the one of you know, an empty arenas. Got eight. That Hoosiers feel to it a little. It does. We, we talked about it earlier. I think this is going to be the one of these, you know, in empty arenas. Got eight. Easier said than done. When you're, when you're a group that wants to create a little flow and score, and after a while, when you just can't get a bucket. Easier said than done. When you're, when you're a group that wants to create a little flow and score, and after a while, when you just can't get a bucket. Well, that's more of a man-to-man -man last couple possessions. Tough call. But he's healthy and fresh no matter what, but... Well, that's more of a man-to-man -man last couple possessions. Tough call. He's healthy and fresh no matter what, but... One of the tops. I mean, he has really been impressive in his time. I think it's he's gotten help playing with guys like Markel Johnson. Now he's asked to facilitate one of the tops. I mean, he has really been impressive in his time. I think it's he's gotten help playing with guys like Markel Johnson. Now he's asked to facilitate. Again, we talked about it one-on-one. -on -one, Brad Davidson gets beat there, but their one-on-one -on -one defense was fantastic. Nate Reavers does that, and he gets a wide-open layup. Again, we talked about it one-on-one. -on -one, Brad Davidson gets beat there, but their one-on-one -on -one defense was fantastic. Nate Reavers does that, and he gets a wide-open layup. Please let me know how you guys did in the comments. Was it tough? Was it easy? Was it a bit medium on par? Uh, also, please drop a like and then share with friends and family who would definitely struggle with this. I'll see y'all in the next video. Dan Dockage. Can't guard me.